Hello everyone, uh, this is Philip back here at Queen Anne's Reef. Uh, we're gonna get back to working on the 310 gallon a day again. Um, got all the, as you guys can see, got all the sand put in. Uh, it's cleared up, just kind of the, the dusty edges that stick to the glass and everything, but the, the bio clarifier cleared it up pretty well. And uh, what we're gonna do today is we're gonna be installing these. Uh, just a security precaution, uh, just watching the water levels as it hits the sump. Uh, we just wanna make sure we got some black backflow prevention that's gonna keep the sump from uh, rolling too much water back into the sump. Um, you always want your nozzles and things like that for a good backflow prevention. So that way you don't flood your floor. But um, yeah, these will be going in on the return lines here. Uh, you actually can see where I've actually marked these where this one will go and then this one right here. So, all right, we're gonna get going on these. Uh, I'll just uh, do a kind of a step-by-step -step on how to cut these guys in. guys so there we have it we've got the uh, the backflow preventers the check valves they are installed um, went pretty good actually didn't have no problems at all um, I've actually turned the core 20s off to uh, inspect to make sure the black backflow preventers are working properly uh, nozzles are slightly uh, below the water line and I uh, just wanted to make sure that as the uh, as the power went off that something didn't refill. So I, I verified all that. Um, you can kind of see the line that it went up to. Uh, the kind of, it's like a, <laughs> you know, the sudsy line there. 
but yeah, it, it filled up about the right there, but that's from the, you know, from the, the what's the, the backwash off the overflow box and everything like that. Uh, worked great. So very pleased with these guys. They were from BRS, just uh, the standard three quarter backflow prevention and uh, worked good. I did the uh, slip to slip unions. Uh, what else can I say? That's, that's it for this one guys. Um, just a little quick mod I did. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, any questions or anything, just leave comments. Uh, help you out the best I can. Um, hope you guys are enjoying this build. It's been a fun build and everything. And uh, I know I've been kind of slow to release some of the material on it and everything. Uh, just been busy with work and all and trying to keep up. Oh, and by the way, I did get the, uh, the auto top off container. It came in. So yeah, that's a, if I'm not mistaken, a 60, roughly 64 gallon auto top off container reservoir. Um, obviously it'll have the ATK on it later, but that's where it's gonna be sitting. Turned out really nice, looks good. All right, you guys, I'm gonna call it for the day. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time.